So I'm here today with Diana, and Diana has a tab. You're uh, towing it with a Jeep. Jeep. And what kind of Jeep do you have? It's a renegade. Renegade. Jeep Renegade. All right. So we're going to take a tour of her setup. Now, how long have you had this? Oh, since April of last year. Just April of last year? So you're brand new. Did you have anything else before this? A uh, very long time ago. Yeah, I had a fifth wheel. I had a, a six-pack. What's a six-pack? Uh, it fits in the ba inside the back of a pickup. A cab over. And they call that a six-pack, huh? Yeah. Uh -huh. And what made you downsize to a little teardrop, basically? Oh, I stopped camping for a while and then I, uh, yeah, and I wanted to get something small and I didn't want, I couldn't go back to just tenting because I have a back issue, so this was perfect. Okay. It everything in it that I was looking for. It, wait till you see this. It <laughs> is fabulous. So let's go ahead and go inside and tell us every, all your luxury in here because okay. it really is very luxurious. For such a small unit yeah, like this. Like it doesn't have anything, right? It just looks tiny. It looks very, very tiny. Yeah. Is this what, about 12 feet? 10? I don't know. It's small. It's only 10, I think. 10 feet. 10 feet long. All right. A regular refrigerator. No freezer. It's running on propane right propane. now. Propane. So your propane tank is out here. That's a good size propane tank. Or is it in there? Is there like two or what? The propane tank is inside with the battery. So, so that's five gallon or ten? You know. I don't know for sure since I'm so new to all of this kind of camping. Okay, and a regular battery. house battery. It's a ship. Uh, what does they call that? Shore battery? It's just connected to the car battery. And then it's the recharging. Uh-huh water and electricity and what else is so I what runs on electricity on here everything can either run on electricity or battery or propane so there's three ways that everything three can ways are is there anything that doesn't work when you're not plugged in mm -hmm. to like a, an outlet a short outlet yeah i can boondock with this i've done that i've just filled up the water at home and yeah. And the battery gets charged when I'm driving the, mm -hmm. the unit. Oh, that's a very nice two burner stove. Let me see if I can get a better look I there. I used it. You I haven't used it? No. Is this brand new? Is this is no, a brand it's new used. unit. It's used. It's used. It looks brand new. I like new. cooking outside, so. Yeah. Uh, do what that. do you cook outside on? Oh, I have a grill and I have a little smoker. And that's stored in here or in that's your Jeep? Stored. The, the grill is in the Jeep and the stove is under, is in the RV storage area. Huh? This kitchen stuff in here mm -hmm. is really nice. Get it working. Hop in here too. Oh, and you can stand up in it, which is nice. So she's just, oh. just got this, so. Come on. Yeah, I just got this. And so you're just kind of figuring out all the gadgets yeah, here, huh? Yeah, the stereo system is really mm -hmm. awesome. Oh, okay, well, there we go. And then how does your your sink work? Just like that, and you pull it out. This shows you what the battery has in it. Black mm -hmm. and gray water. Uh, and here is the... Now this is awesome. Yeah. Look at this. Yeah, she yeah. has the bathroom. her commode and she shower. has a shower. I have never seen a shower like this in a little teardrop. A 10 foot teardrop. <laughs> no. Unbelievable. And a fan and a vent. Oh, okay. Let me see. Oh yeah, there it goes. Okay. Yeah. Just yeah. learn. Just figuring it out here, huh? And then you, is this an air conditioner or it's an heater? air conditioner. Oh, and a TV. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Anyway. And you have a, a very large bed. I think it's a queen. I think it's a queen, too. So you did have a table in here, in here too. And cushions to sit there and here. So can you convert it very easily if you wanted to have a, a I dining I table? To. Now, no. I have the foam mattress and I have an egg crate. 
Uh, so I don't have that area, but I like to hang outdoors, so I wouldn't be sitting in here eating or anything. Okay. But when you oh. bought it, it did come with a dinette convertible yes. uh -huh. to a bed. So yes, there's that option with this yes, unit. And the mattress was, you know, pretty small. Yeah. Um, oh, that's convenient, huh? Uh -huh. For your storage. And in the back. Do you have storage in underneath your bed as well? Yes. Okay. A small area. And then there's another storage space. Okay, so you have here. all your, yeah. That's you have it. a fire extinguisher there. That's why people mm -hmm. tend to forget those. Those things are so it's important to have. Utensils and lots of storage. Yeah. Well, this is just like a small little RV, isn't it? Yeah. You have everything. I have everything I need. This is very, very nicely designed. Beautiful. So, where do you like to camp? I like the ocean. I like the redwoods. Uh huh. And my water, if I can. I haven't, um, I've gone up to Cradle Lake, that was my first trip, and then I went over to Bodega Bay, I liked it there, it's right by the ocean, it's just... Do you mostly solar camp, or do you meet up with friends, or groups, or... Uh, I thought it'd be nice to join Girl Camper, so I could meet up with people and hopefully make some camping friends. Yeah. And camp around, and see what there is to see. I've been everywhere in California, New Mexico, and Utah. But, you know, I like to travel around. Do you get to travel much, or are you still working? I'm still working. So I make four-day weekends, and I travel that way until I retire, if I ever retire. Yeah? What is it that you do, if I may ask? Oh, I'm a, a, a psychotherapist for Contra Costa County Probation. Okay. Yeah. Well, that must cool. be very rewarding work. It is. It's been rewarding all yeah. my life, and I love it. I'm mm -hmm. really lucky to get into that yeah awesome yeah. is there any other magical things that you can think of that we haven't shown yet uh, no, what do you love most about your um, little camper most oh gosh everything everything just it just everything. fits I've, your style yeah huh? i've never had all of this in, in a, a camping vehicle before mm-hmm uh, not the bath. The bathroom, I think, is the most convenient. The bathroom. I like that lots. Yeah. Um, How has is this? This you've towed before, though, right? So this isn't okay. your first towable, is it? Well, fifth wheel. The fifth wheel. Yeah. It's kind of not really. Well, I guess it's towing. Yeah. It's more attached, though, yeah, isn't it's in it? The... How has this been? What's been the difference between the fifth wheel lugging that around and this little one? I hardly feel this one when I'm driving. It doesn't feel like I'm pulling anything. Okay. Unless I'm going up a steep incline. But, and you're uh, used to the length. Oh, yeah. It's very short. And it and, and it's not that wide, so I can go through drive throughs and, uh, That's a plus. Yeah, I like that. Mm -hmm. um, it's just easy to have attached. And um, I was tired of being home from COVID for two years. And, right. Uh, uh, so I decided, um, I was looking for a trailer and, um, I needed to go back to New York, uh, for a funeral. Mm. And this one just, well, became, it suddenly just... became available. It was the first one I saw. And I thought it was, uh, nice that it just happened like that. So I just quick bought it. And, you gotta take, you have to take those opportunities, don't you? Yeah, yeah. When you up. find an opportunity, you have to grab it, just because if it. not now, when, right? Exactly. Do you ever just camp and then drop this at your camp and then go off in your Jeep? Yes, absolutely. I did okay. That. Create a lake. Uh, mm -hmm. So that's a big it's advantage. A to be able to drop it, yeah. Mm -hmm. So you have the convenience of having an RV, but mm -hmm. then the convenience of having really an off-road vehicle. Mm-hmm. Oh, this I is just it. lovely. It just has a tiny storage space. Okay, you have more storage down under here, or is this? Yes. Look at those little tires. <laughs> <laughs> this is so cute. Yeah, I don't know where the electrical cord and the water. The spare is supposed to go underneath, and it's supposed to be a crank, but it didn't come with um, that apparatus. For some reason, and I didn't want to have to go under there to get it, so I had mm -hmm. that paid. 
And then you put down these little braces. Oh yeah, they're gonna level it out. Uh -huh. Stables it out. Yeah. I don't bounce around as much in there. And level it, yeah. Very, very nice. I've enjoyed meeting you and yeah, thank, thank you, you for so showing much. us your little house on wheels, it's basically. My I love it. Yeah. Thank you. Is this your happy place? Yeah, it is. I yeah. Really love it. And you have a home base then too? Sure. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you. All right. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Thank you.